Hello everybody, my name is Sandra. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video, I wanted to share with you some products I got from some uh, different shops. Um, some of them are from Etsy and some of them have their own standalone alone websites. Um, so most of the planner companies that I have been kind of look, looking at and um, been subscribed to have their own website. Um, and I think a lot of people, that's kind of what they do. So they go, they start on Etsy because it's easy to get started on Etsy and the fees are low unless you sell products and then you grow your own website and then you start building it. Kind of like building an empire. <laughs> um, so, and I've done the same thing, although I started with my website first and then I went to Etsy after, which is kind of like backwards, but whatever it is what it is. So uh, the companies that I ordered from that you'll see here in this haul, I've got Ollie Block, I've got um, the Honey Bee Shop, I've got Heather B. Co. on Etsy, and then I've got Jane's Agenda. Okay, so I have ordered from Ollie Block, Heather B. Co. and the Honey Bee Shop before, but Jane's Agenda is new to me. Um, I'm currently not subscribed to Jane's Agenda, but I love everything that came. Um, I didn't open anything up from Jane's Agenda because I wanted to share with you guys the packaging that it came in first, okay? Very excited about that. So another thing here that I have to mention is when I saw Jane's Agenda, um, some of the products, I'm going to have to show you guys to really explain it proper. The There are different types of dashboards you can get, and that's kind of what I mostly focused on here, except for these two companies over here. Um, were the dashboards. That's kind of where it is right now for me because I'm thinking of decorating my planner with new dashboards and as I switch out my, my binders, because as you might know, I love Franklin Covey binders. I am in a classic size, which is a half letter insert size. And um, the dashboards that I've been getting from various other shops, including Heather B. Co., they're very flimsy. So some of the, the dashboards I receive from Heather they rip easy, the ink will um, run if it gets wet, and so uh, Jane's agenda, agenda, so some of the cardboard inserts um, or the dashboards, they're fine standalone as is, but the, um, the not the acetate, because you can get different types of acetate. You can get really flimsy acetate, and then you can get one that's a bit thicker. Um, and I find that Heather B. Co., the acetate that she she gave that I received in today's order was very flimsy, very um, bendable. Um, if you were to fold it, it would fold really easily. And Jane's Agenda, basically, um, a lot of her stuff is laminated. Okay, so it's the first time I've ever seen anything being laminated when it comes to a dashboard. So I kind of did the same thing with Heather's. Um, I got this card. It says, I am proud of who I am. It's kind of like the freebie, if you will. And then these three dashboards are what I received. So when I got them, this one was actually a vellum and these two were acetates, but I went ahead and I laminated my own. So I do have a laminator. Um, I used a five millimeter paper, uh, laminating paper, and then I cut around the edges so that it stayed sealed on all corners because it was so like fine, but I don't want it to bend or get wrecked in my planner. So this one, I got my name. It says Sandra, and I hope you can see this, but it's actually like rainbow foil. Like, can you see how cool is that? So rainbow foil, because I want to do like a rainbow theme, um, kind of like not, not completely rainbow, but um, kind of to an extent, have some really colorful stuff in my planner. But I think that is just so pretty. And then the other two, this one says, first I drink the coffee, then I do the things. Like, that is so nice. And then the last one says 2020, 2023. <laughs> so this would technically go at the front of my planner. So those are the three dashboards I got from Heather. <clears throat> and like I said, I went ahead and I did actually laminate my own. Okay. The other thing that I did that um, I'll probably have to link, link for you because I got this from Amazon was I have this Cad Cadomero Pro round corner rounder. And with Franklin Covey inserts, the inside corner is always rounded. So I went ahead and rounded my corners and I'm gonna do that for all of my dashboards I received today. Um, the outside corner stays pointy 
And then I also hole punched my inserts. And I, again, because they're half letter, I use the Franklin Covey hole punch for um, seven rings. And um, that just fits my planner perfectly. So those are the things that I did there. Okay, so that was from Heather B. Co. The next company was Ollie Block. And again, kind of sticking with the rainbow theme. These are the newest rainbow Ollie clips, which I am in love with. Like, look how pretty that is. I love it. Um, and then there's this one as well. There's only one that I didn't order, and I can't remember which one it was, but I thought those are so pretty. Okay. Um, I'm obsessed with all the clips. I didn't think I was going to be obsessed, but my favorite size is large. These are large. I think Jumbo is way too big, even for my half letter classic size Franklin Covey. I don't think I need Jumbo. Large is good, and usually I prefer the small ones because they just bulk up your planner too much if you use a lot of them. Okay, now from the Honey Bee Shop, I just wanted to show you the packaging. So it came, it was it was in a different package to come in, but this is the envelope that everything was wrapped in, which I thought was so adorable. It has like this little bee, and it says packed with lots of love and honey. And um, so now the only thing is, I just wanted to share this with you guys. So what I had ordered were actually these. These are like the Stardust washi tape cards. Um, I don't know if that's what they're called, but this is what I'd ordered. And they had hollow foil with like the today, week, month, and then the little stars on them. This is what I wanted. And I got sent, um, I actually got two of these. I'd ordered two and this is what I got sent. So I'm assuming that she was all out of stock of the hollow foil ones and I feel kind of bummed because I didn't want these. If I had known I was going to get these, I would have not wanted them at all because I have like literally no use for them. I wanted these ones <laughs> to go with my rainbow theme. Um, so that was kind of important to me, but um, it is what it is. So those uh, rainbow ones are from, a, or the hollow ones were from a previous order I had placed with the Honey Bee Shop. So I ended up getting these. It still says today, a week, and month. So basically you use them, um, you put labels on them, and then you use them as a task card. So I got two copies of those. I also got this adorable ruler. So this is a rose gold ruler. It's got these little doodles on it, and it says the Honey Bee Shop. The only problem with it is it's very, very flimsy. So when I first got it, it actually came dented. You can still see a little dent right here. I had to bend it back. Um, but I thought this is the most adorable thing to have in your planner because it's rose gold. I wanted it so bad. Okay. Then the other thing I got were these washi cards as well. These are the perfect size to fit in my Franklin Covey um, card pocket, like the four, four pocket card slot thing. Um, but I'm going to use them as deco because um, it says library card, which I thought is adorable. Right. Um, this one says just, oops. It says just one more chapter, which is something that, you know, I said all the time as a kid growing up when my mom was like, it's time for bed, turn off your light. And I would read until so late <laughs> all the time. And then this one matches one of my, um, one of my dashboards, my planner. So I had ordered this paper um, from the honeybee shop last time and then I cut it down to size to fit my half letter and it matches this and this rose gold and these are definitely going in the front of my planner just for deco okay I also got three of these die cut stickers so this one says magical plans which I am in love with this sticker you guys it is utterly gorgeous I got this one which is a magical potion like an herbal potion and then this one says I am magic which just, I love these stickers so much. And then as a freebie, I got this little card. I'm assuming it's a journaling card and it says planner babe and then 50 sheets. So it's like a, one of those composition notebooks, but it's pink. So I'm going to put this in my pink planner, which I'm using right now. I'm using my beautiful life, Teresa Collins, um, yeah, beautiful life binder. So, um, I'm very happy with these other than those, um, task washi tape cards. I'm really happy with this as well. Okay, so moving on to Jane's agenda. I'm not going to show you the back because um, that is 
that has my address on it. But this is the package that it came in. It's hard to zoom out. I don't know if I can. There we go. So um, it's got this flower pattern. It says janesagenda.com. Okay, so I never opened up anything because I just wanted to show you guys how nice this packaging is. Every single dashboard has its own envelope, okay? So with my business, I use these same envelopes to put my sticker orders in. I think they might be a bit smaller, though I can't remember. Um, but everything has a sticker on it. It says Jane's Agenda with this little flower side of it. And nothing's hole punched, so I always punch my own but everything is half letter size. So I got two of these pocket quote cards. So they're basically adhesive pockets that you can attach to your um, either dashboard or inbox if you have like a hard plastic inbox. Um, also, you can use them on your dividers if you want to. So I'm not going to take it off, but it just, it's, um, I'm, I don't need that. I might as well just take all the packaging off. It's just this plastic pocket that you use to um, put things in in your planner. There was a thank you card. So I'm just going to take all of these out so I don't have to deal with it later. So I got two of those. Okay. And then I got some really cute and unique paper clips. So the first one are these square paper clips. So you can put them on like at an angle so that it looks like this. And I thought that was really adorable. Or you can do it this way. Um, but I just love that. So these are gold. I also got these hexagon ones. Um, or are they octagon? One, two, three, four, five, six. No, they're hexagon. It even says right on the front. Okay. And I think those are also absolutely adorable. Um, so they're just simply a hexagon, but it just adds like the cutest little planner. Um, you know, it just, it, it's such a cute little touch and it makes your planner unique. Okay, and these ones, Okay, these ones are all gold as well, and it says plan. I just want to try these out and see what they look like. I like this. So it actually has like the word when you like do this, it actually shows you the letter. Plan. Okay, so that's really cute. Now let's start getting into some of these dashboards. So I'm just going to open them all up. So this one, I don't think they have the names of them and I can't remember exactly what they were called. So this is definitely laminated, okay? Um, it's not overly thick. It's actually really thin, um, but it was definitely a foiled one. And um, I love this so much. Like that is, to me, that is so pretty. Um, and so what I do, I normally would round the corners, but they're already rounded. And then I would just hole punch it. So I'll just do that right now. There we go. Okay, the next ones. <clears throat> now these ones are called Summer's End. And they're just so pretty. So they're all cardstock and they are double sided. I love that so much. So no matter what way you flip it over, it has that design on both sides. So this one is meant to be facing that way. I'm pretty sure this one could honestly be facing either way, but I think I'll, I don't know. It doesn't really matter, but once I hole punch it, it will matter. So I think I'll leave that. I'm going to think about this one for a while, but I think these are just so pretty. Okay, and they're smooth to the touch. Next set is the soft floral. And these are gonna look really, really nice in my current planner. 
So the only thing I notice about these ones is that they are not, um, the corner is not rounded. So these ones, again, you could put them any different way, but uh, I'll figure that out after. So all I'll do is round the inside corner when I decide that, and then I'll also um, hole punch them. Okay, the next set I got um, the Breathe Landscapes. So this one says inhale, exhale, slow down and breathe. And like, I love these. These are utterly gorgeous. They're so like calm and serene and quiet. I love that. Um, the next one is live, love, dream. And then again, this was a um, laminated vellum. And this one is only one side. So I'm going to hole punch this right now. And then um, the way that Jane has it, you can honestly put it over top of any different other dashboard. Like this looks good. Um, that looks really nice. And then this looks good. <laughs> so, you, I mean, you can't go wrong. Okay, and then the next set, or one, I guess, I did get these, so they're both kind of the same. Um, they're French handwriting, one's in white and one's in black. Okay, so I just went ahead and opened up the rest of the packages because I thought it would um, save some time. But I just wanted to, like, I'd have to say that I love the quality of these so much. Like, everything here is beautiful and magnificent. The one thing I would say, if it would help to cut costs. I would prefer to have um, cheaper packaging, like less plastic, less, you know, less stickers, um, and still keep the, the product itself the same quality um, and have the packaging come down a notch, I think, um, if that would save on cost. But if, if the cost would be the same, then it doesn't matter because the products themselves are absolutely breathtaking. So this is the, they're both vellum. This is the one with black writing on it. And then this is white writing. So again, um, this one might not go so well with like the outdoor ones. I think there's there's also this like Paris one that's offered and I think would be beautiful. Like this looks quite nice. And I like how the vellum kind of makes the color behind a little bit less bright and vibrant. Although I like bright and vibrant. That's kind of my thing. But um, like I think that would look really pretty. Like anything flowery would go really, really nicely. Maybe not the black one so much, but okay. And then I also got this one. So this is another vellum, but it's got some leaves on it, which I think is really pretty. Um, I don't know how that goes. I think that's just by itself. Or if you can get something underneath of it where you can see a bit of writing here and a bit of writing there, that would look really pretty. Like if you could find another dashboard underneath or even a piece of paper, you could print it yourself and have like Sandra's Planner 2023 or something like that. That would look so pretty. So I kind of left my favorites to the very last. This is my absolute favorite. I love this dashboard. Again, it's another vellum that is laminated and that is so pretty. I love it. And if you put it over top like a white piece of paper, it would look even more breathtaking. Like, um, let's see. There. Isn't it pretty? I love that so much. I'm putting that in my planner right away. Okay. And then I also got this. This was, um, it could be used as a bookmark or like, um, like it says, I got today. You can get today or inbox. And I got today so I can put it um, in the middle of my um, like wherever my today is in my planner and I'm not sure whether I'll use these intermix between my work or my my personal planners but I love this all right guys so that's it for my haul I just couldn't wait to share these because I wanted to use the products so bad so thank you so much for watching if you have any questions please let me know um, leave a comment if you enjoyed this haul and this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you are new, please consider subscribing. Click on the bell button and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye friends.